Okay, well, what we're going to look at in this video is looking at why the DST compressor is so effective at helping a golfer understand how and why and when they're swinging the golf club on the correct plane and reaching the optimal impact position. Now, you can see that the DST compressor is curved. It's got a curved shaft when seen from a face-on perspective. So you can see the curve here, and that replicates the shape of a normal golf club under its maximum load in the optimal impact position when the when the ball and the turf or the club face is absorbing the ball and the turf through the strike so it kind of helps you identify and feel that position for yourself interestingly when we uh, started the dst compressor journey we realized that uh, it was all about impact and we were looking at it really from a face-on perspective helping a golfer understand to get their hands in front of the line of tension and maintain the pressure and the tension in the shaft until after the ball has been struck. And that's absolutely critical for all golfers of any standard. What's interesting is that we didn't expect the phenomenal uptake uh, of the DST compressors being used by tour professionals. And they use it not only for that purpose of getting the hands in front of the line of tension, but they also use it from a down the line perspective. So you can see it's curved from a face-on perspective, but when I turn the shaft and you look at it from a down-the-line perspective, you can see now that the shaft looks straight. Now, what's interesting is that if I swing this club and it comes off the plane line, so if I do a bad swing and I come at the ball too much from, the, from an inside path, I'm exaggerating this a little bit, you can see that it develops a curve again. And due to the balance of the club, the, the club will want to under-rotate. And that means that the hosel of the golf club will be presented to the ball, producing either a straight block or one of those interesting Egyptian fades that we don't want to talk about that just go right very quickly. And uh, conversely, if you're swinging the club too much from an outside plane coming into the ball, due to the balance of the club again, it'll exaggerate the fault and the club face will want to close very quickly. And again, you can see a curve in the shaft here. So what I mean by... Uh, the the club being swung down the plane line is that in an ideal world what we'd like what we'd like to see is that the uh, the club head moving from an inside position to the ball making contact with the ball and then being swung on the plane line so the club head comes back inside the uh, the, the the target line now what we see quite a lot with good players is that the longer the club uh, so when you get into the longer irons and in, indeed the woods, what tends to happen is that a golfer tends to stand up through impact and that produces a position where their backside moves under them and their hands come away from the plane line producing a, a position where the, the, the club head is coming too much from an inside plane and they're forced to save the shot with lots of hand movement and hands rolling over. Now that's either going to produce one of two very dramatic results with the DSD compressor. Either the ball is going to go straight right when it's coming from an inside path, or clearly if the balance point changes, the club head will close very quickly producing a pull hook. Now the feeling you'll want to have with the DSD compressor in order to hit straight shots, we want to feel as if we're making contact with the ball not by using our hands and arms and wrists into impact but by rotating our upper bodies towards the target and holding our hands relatively passive through impact so the feeling we want to have is that we're hitting a sort of like a hold off cut and that way we're rotating our bodies and pivoting through impact really well and getting our weight into our lead side so we're not so dependent upon using our wrists and our hands to square the club face up to the ball. So I hope that helps and um, we'll, look at, have, we'll have a look at one or two more instances um, and scenarios um, regarding other, other situations in a moment.